guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Just Click the Dancing Avon Lady, and today is the day. Today is the two week Mission Lux Rev update video. It's actually been a little bit more than two weeks. I think it's about, been about two and a half weeks. I did miss two times. I missed two times putting on the cream, but other than that, I did it every single day, day and night. Day and night, guys, day and night, because I really wanted to see what I could do for my skin in about two weeks' time. There have been so much excitement on the posts and the videos that I have posted, uh, as well as in general, on the Avon uh, group pages about this magnificent product. A lot of people have messaged me and talked to me about the product and how much they love it. Even my business development manager now, she is a skincare believer. And she said to me, I think it was yesterday, that... It's amazing how different her skin feels after just using it for one week. Like one week made a huge difference for her. So anyways, I'm gonna go on with my testimony. So on my face right now, all I did was I just I just cleansed my face in the mornings. I usually just do water and then micellar water. If you don't have a bottle of this, get yourself a bottle of micellar water, guys. It is life-changing. <laughs> And then I just have a little bit of eye cream on. But besides that, the only other things I have on my face right now is mascara and strawberry lip balm, which is exactly the same thing as I did with my original video so that pretty much everything looks the same. First off, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to show you my current skincare routine that I was doing for the full two week, well, the full two-ish weeks. And all I did was after I washed my face, I would first use my ampoule, which is the Dr. Belmer Sitka Peptide Ampoule. Um, I hope I'm pronouncing that properly. But yeah, at first I thought that this wasn't doing anything for my face. And now I love it. It just feels like it preps my skin and it just makes it ready for the day. Sorry, it's allergy season, so my eye is really itchy. It just makes me, me feel like my skin is ready to take on whatever it wants, needs to absorb. So I don't find it moisturizing, but I do feel like it preps my skin. So I did a, did I do a video on this? I feel like I did a video on it, but I never, did I never release it? Oh my God. I'm sorry, guys. I'm going to look back on my old stuff and find out whether or not I released it. So I just put it on my palm, I warm it up and then I just press into my skin. I love the scent of it. It's like this warm, beautiful, gingery scent. This just smells very healthy. After that, besides that and my eye cream, I didn't use anything else. After using it for tooth, I'm gonna show you my skin. And I have noticed a difference. I hope it kind of shows uh, well through the actual camera. Um, but I do, the biggest thing that I noticed, and surprisingly, even my husband noticed, okay? My husband said it to me without even prompting him. He was just like, babe, your skin feels so much softer, like so much softer. Literally, it's like my baby's butt when it's clean. Yes, he's teething. And for parents who have gone through the teething phase, you know what that means. <laughs> but yeah, but my skin feels so soft and so supple. Like that's like one of the biggest things that I did really, really notice over the two week period is the texture of my skin, how much more velvety and just soft and cushy it is. It's just, oh. This is so nice. Like the texture of my skin has uh, definitely, I noticed that is the biggest difference is that my skin feels incredibly soft and incredibly smooth. I know I do have a little breakout here. It is getting close to my monthly friend coming to visit, so that's what happens with me. You'll see it in my other video too, that my first video, you could see a little mark. That was the beginning of it. And then it kind of, it brought along a friend. Okay, so I do not attribute that to the Mission Lux Rev because if it is, I would have gotten more along other areas of my face of for pimples. So a couple of other things I did really notice the difference is that the little marks on my face, like the freckles and things, even though they're still there, I do feel that they are a little bit lighter. Especially the one on the side here. This is the side that gets more sun because of when I drive. And although I, I do use SPF, um, it just naturally more sun hits it. The other thing that I noticed is that my skin has a really nice glow right now. Like it just, without any primer, without any makeup, without any concealer, without any highlighter, it feels like it naturally has a bit more of that 
just healthy glow to my skin. Let me know in the comments below what you think, but I do feel that my skin looks a lot more even and glowy and dewy, which is going towards that whole ideal of glass skin and just really healthy, healthy skin so that you don't even feel like you need to wear a foundation every day. Another huge significant difference I've noticed is the redness under my nose. Right around here, there's still some, but if, um, because I'm comparing it to my actual first video, and I do notice that it is a little bit lighter. Like it's not as angry looking, it's not as bright. It is still there, but I feel like it's definitely, it's better than it has been in a really, really long time without the use of concealers and without the use of, you know, any, or felt like a, a tinted moisturizer or foundation. So that's definitely a huge bonus. And like I said, the only difference I did was just changing my skincare products. Um, I did not use a mask over two weeks because I wanted to not treat my face with anything else except for the products. And the other thing that I significantly noticed was how makeup sits on my skin. So I don't wear full face foundation a lot, but I did notice for a when I was shooting a couple of videos that the foundation laid on my skin a lot smoother and a lot more even than before. I don't think I would have noticed a difference before in the past until there is a difference now. Does that even make sense? I think that makes sense because before I was just like, okay, my skin, my foundation's on, yay. But now I'm like, oh, look how much more even that is. And look how much more just, it just, it feels a lot better going on. And it looks a little less patchy and I don't have to go back into just, you know, do touch-ups after I do my first layer, which is great. So I think that also means that overall, my skin in general is more evenly hydrated. I, I think that's what it means. So mind you, disclaimer, guys, I'm not a skincare expert. I'm not a makeup artist. I am a makeup enthusiast and I have a slight obsession with skincare and lip products and pretty much anything like to do with makeup. So that's my disclaimer. But as a consumer, that's what I noticed, that I feel like my skin in general is just overall a lot more hydrated and evenly hydrated, which is really important because a lot of times the fine lines that you have are not really wrinkles yet. What they are is just, it's your skin just needs moisture. Now, I want to show you how I have been using the products. I am still on the first mini tube. This is how little of the products you actually need. I'm going to insert a picture up here with how much I normally use of my power serum, which is this one. Oh my God, I feel like I've been cheating on this. I've been cheating on you. I'm so sorry, baby. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I still love you, but this is a bit of an upgrade. So then you can compare really the difference of the amount that I actually need to use. So with this one here, all you really need is just a teeny tiny amount. That's it. Only this little bit, okay? So I want to do the actual routine itself. What I do is I just kind of massage it in. Oh my God. And every time I put it on, it's like, a little spa moment for my face. It's just, it's taking me far away to a land that is just, I'm surrounded by beauty and magic. <laughs> Every time, like literally, I know it sounds all trippy and it sounds all fluffy, but whenever I put it on, it's just such a beautiful experience that I'm just like, oh my God. <laughs> so then what you need to do is you need to let it absorb in. So after I put it on, then I just pat. I just pat, 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 pat. All right, I put my glasses on so I can see you guys, but I thought I was gonna talk more, but I'm not. I'm gonna pat while I talk. So you need to let this product soak into your skin a little bit, guys. You really, really do. I let this sit. And then what I do is I get my little spoon. <coughs> which is still like the most fun thing to use, guys. And you know what you could even use with the other end? You know, I wonder if you can use like a massager. Oh, oh. You can probably even use a massager. I didn't even think about that until now. Huh? Oh. You now sometimes when you have a headache, pressure's a little bit low today, guys. So, ooh. Okay, use the other end as a little massager. Anyways, so then I take my beautiful bottle of Mission Lux Rev. Literally, in two and a half weeks, I'm going to show you how much of the product I have used. Look, that is it. Do you see that top line? Okay, okay, that is all the product that I have used. I have barely made a dent in this because 
this just requires so little product like this is gonna last me so long so then okay i just take my little spoon here or my little spatula and all i do is i just get a teeny tiny little bit of actually it might even be a little bit much okay that is all i need super teeny tiny amount an insanely little amount then i take it put it on my finger make sure i got absolutely everything because i do not want to waste and then up and out oh my god it's just literally it's it's a it transforms your mental space oh. okay then final step that i've been doing for the last two weeks taking my eclat dior roller which i have several videos for and then i just roll out this baby now you'll notice that when you do the rolling it does bring circulation to the top of your face, like to the top part of your skin. So you're going to notice the face turns a little bit more pinky. It's not from a reaction. It literally is just because I'm increasing blood flow. That has been my skincare routine for the last two weeks. I haven't really had to go outside. And so I haven't used, I haven't had to use um, like an SPF. And if I did, I just used the a new one and i can't even talk like you have to be the, your own judge you have to decide whether or not this product will be is right for you to try i love skincare products i've always wanted to try another luxury skincare product um i've never used anything as luxurious as uh, mission lux rev but i am so glad that i did because the a the mystery of it is gone and two i did really notice a, an experience like it really has been an incredible like look at my skin guys i mean i don't want to sound vain but i think my skin looks pretty freaking awesome like considering i do have sun damage i'm in my late 30s <laughs> i think my skin looks pretty pretty awesome right like, I mean, I know I don't have the most flawless skin and I'm okay with that. I'm okay with my freckles, but I just, I feel like this has caused, like it's, the Mushroom Luxe Rev has really helped even out my skin tone a lot, especially underneath my nose here, which has always been a very self-conscious area for me. Like I would always put like a um, concealer here just because I have all the redness under my nose. And honestly, the concealer, often it would just kind of rub off because I'd have to blow my nose so many times during the day. And so now I feel a little bit more confident that I don't even need that much, like, or, or even at all, right? So it just, I am so happy with this product. Would I rebuy it? 100% definitely, yes. I definitely would rebuy it, 100%. And when I finish up this bottle, like this jar, and the serum I, I ordered, it's... <laughs> on back order right now so i'm waiting luckily i got a bunch of free minis so i'll be able to use this one a couple of things i'm gonna i'm going to be continuing to introduce back into my skin will be masks and the other thing i will try to reintroduce will be the the cannabis sativa facial oil as a finishing oil i probably won't do it day and night i might just do it at night if you want to be able to save a little bit more money on this product my suggestion is if you're not a representative and you don't have a membership my and you for some reason don't want one if you do want one click my easter link down below <laughs> but my suggestion would be to use the mission lux rev on your face and under your chin your neck and your chest use a different line from a new okay or dr belmere or the belief all right depending on what you're trying to target okay that is what i would suggest okay like i said though i'm not a skincare specialist that is just what i would do do as a consumer okay um, another possibility is you can just use this at night i might end up doing that when the weather gets even warmer because it is a more rich 
facial cream, I might not like sweating in it as much. But so far, it's been perfectly fine. There was a day it was 18 degrees out. It wasn't, it wasn't uncomfortable on my skin, which is fine. I would probably suggest that when you first start off for at least the first three weeks, well, at least the first two weeks to a month or so or six weeks, use it as directed day at night. And then for a little bit more long-term maintenance, switch to nighttime use only because I feel that's probably the time when you're resting and you're sleeping, when your cells regenerate and rejuvenate a little bit more. I mean, this is, I think, I think that's how it works in my mind. So if there's any scientific back background to it, I don't know. That's just, I think I heard that somewhere one time and I stuck with it. And that's been my mantra for skincare. That is what makes sense to me as a consumer, not as an expert. I do make no claims that I'm an expert in this, guys. All I just say is that is what I would do as a consumer. And that's that. You do you. You decide what makes what works for you. I absolutely freaking redonkously love the Mission Lux Rev, I think it is an incredible product and definitely worth its value. The other thing that I think I've noticed is that my pores seem a little bit more refined. I don't know if I can say that they're smaller because I don't know if anything can really change the size of your pores, but they do look a little bit more refined. I think it's because also my skin feels a little bit firmer, like it feels a little bit more not taunt, not, I don't, it's not taunt, but it feels a little bit more bouncy. <laughs> like there's more elasticity. Yeah. Yeah. I can't say good enough good things about this product, guys. Like I understand it's really pricey. I do. I get it that it's really pricey. Would I buy it again? 100%. Yes, I would definitely rebuy it because I really do believe in the product. I really love what it's done for my skin so far. I would cut out on my, from other areas of my fund money to probably save up for this like that that's just me and you have to decide what is best for you if you've ever been curious about japanese skincare and you've been wanting to try a luxurious product like a luxury skincare product your skin is the largest organ on your body you have to take care of it and so i would like i would prefer to spend the money on my skincare than on let's say a name brand purse that's just me like literally that's just me and also because I'm really really clumsy I've spilt my baby's milk into my purses before so <laughs> I just know how I am and this this will be a better bang for my buck and literally I use a little product that it's just amazing verdict love it we'll buy it again 100% do I recommend it <sighs> Ooh, yes I don't remember my audience. Yes, 100%. I would definitely recommend this product. It's one of the most exciting skincare products I've ever used in my life. Hands down. Hands down. The experience of putting it on in its on its own, it's incredible. I just, it makes me feel good. It really does. And if it makes me feel good, I'm going to keep using it, right? I mean, if something makes me feel kind of poopy and crappy about it, I probably won't be consistent. This has been the most consistent I've ever been with my skincare, guys. 100%. I'm just telling you no lie. This is the most consistent I've been. Like, only missing two out of two and a half weeks. That's really good for me because a lot of times I'm so tired, especially when Nathaniel won't sleep and it's four in the morning. I am so tired. All he wants to do is be bounced and held. I'm going on a rampage again. I'll link the video, the original video for this in my description box down below. If you guys want to learn more about this beautiful dynamic duo, the Mission Lux Rev, make sure you do click my Easter link down below. And while you're there, have you ever thought about becoming a beauty brand ambassador? You can represent this amazing company and make money online just about talking about products and sharing your Easter link. If you're interested in doing that, make sure you do send me a private message or just go to that Easter link and click that join Avon button and I will be here to mentor you along the way, show you how to get started and how to use your e-store link to really build a business. If you guys are new to this channel, make sure you do me a favor, please give me some love. It helps me out a lot. I really do appreciate it and it's free for you to do. Hit that subscribe button as well as that little bell icon beside it so you never miss a video notification. I have new videos out every single week about product reviews, business tips, dance adventures, and more. I love you guys. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.